my hair, it is whack. It's the day after I bought that bike. I can't remember if I mentioned this or not, but I'm going up to Jake Jake the Toilet Snake's house, and we are going to possibly ride this thing. Possibly. I'm not 100% sure. I kind of want to go through the bike a little bit. You guys can probably understand that. I like to prevent something terrible from happening before I completely jump on it and say, okay, let's rip it like we've never ripped anything before. Like, ride it like we stole it kind of thing. Remember these old days? I guess we'll find out. Me and you, at this point in time, I have no idea. That's all this channel used to be, is Jake and I going out on our dirt bikes and me going out on my motorcycle and how this channel's developed in the best way possible. We're gonna bring it back to the roots. You know, that's where we started. We started in the ground as a seed and then we started dirt biking in four wheel and then we sprouted out into a beautiful tree. Is it a redwood in California, the big redwoods? They're like 1,500 years old or something like that? If so, yeah, that. That's what this channel has developed into. But now we're going back to the roots. Like, not 100%, but, you know, we're gonna be ripping these things. I'm also bringing a textbook up to Jake for one of his college classes. He sent it to my address. Must be a sketchy book, huh? No, I, I'm sure it's just, like, a college book. Well, I got something for you, Jake. What? YouTubers uh, think it's very, very sketchy. I made some wise remarks, and they, they're sketched out. Are you excited? This is this I is am. gonna be the first time that we're gonna like take this out of the truck. I'm so excited! Jake the toilet snake can't hide it. Woo! <laughs> Doesn't she look braptastic? Braptastic is definitely an adjective. We're still gonna go to the bike. We're, Jake's just really excited and I'm really excited. I'm sorry. But if we do end up going out, I do want to have the GoPros ready. This one's Jake's. Well, I let him use it. That sounds braptastic. Jake, your GoPro is locked and loaded, buddy. All you KTM fanatics, leave it in the comment section below what you have rode and if you've ever had problems with your gear oil that you run. Because we can all learn together. Like if Rotella makes the best, then we all should use Rotella. If Valvoline makes the best, we should all run Valvoline. If Mobile One, you know, all that kind of stuff. I'm gonna run a little Yamalube. What are you gonna run? Yamalube. You can't be running Yamalube, dude. It's a KTM. Well, it's either Yamalube or Kawasaki Lube. It's gonna be He's got the name brand stuff. He ain't messing around. <laughs> no, I'm sure Yama Lube's completely fine. I just wanted to make that remark because she's not a Yamaha. People were saying synthetic. with the Recluse, yep, Rotella T6 full synthetic. Yeah. I actually don't remember how much this takes, but I think it's 0.7. I have to say, yours looks prettier. Like, mm -hmm. just because of this sticker and like this sticker. It's just all in the stickers. Viewers have sent me two kickstands and I Woo! We got a little scared there, buddy. Well, I will be completely honest with you guys. I did want to ride today and I'm kind of disappointed. Not so much in the bike because, you know, you can't really blame the bike. It's used, it's, it's old, it's a 2007, it's 2017 right now. So I'm not blaming the bike and I'm not blaming myself. I'm just disappointed that I can't ride with Jake today because I know he wants to ride. I wouldn't mind rocking that. Is the other one good? That's freaking awesome. We'll take that, Jake. That's better than metal on metal. Okay, then uh, things just changed around. I just don't have front brakes. My master cylinder shot on the front brakes, and that's 70% of my braking. So I'm only down to 30%, so I can't be ripping. 
like super super fast because otherwise I'm just gonna skid out because it's really really wet. And you have uh, rear brake pads that I decided were garbage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, and he's the one who just rips anything. Okay, well we'll just take these out and uh, get to it. I just gotta remember I can't, I have nothing up here that really sucks. Throwing all the rear brake pads. I know. Give me crap while I run my brake pads and I pull it out and you're like, oh, yeah, it's got a little bit. I'll run that. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see how much was on there? Huh? A blast from the past, buddy old pal. I'm riding no goggles. No goggles, it is there. No goggles. KTM bros for life. This is why riding with no brakes is stupid as all hell. I just crashed into that tree. I don't know, I've never been on a two-stroke without the stabilizer. Wanna ride this one? I think you just wanna ride this one. I wanna feel the stabilizer. You can, just remember you don't get no front brakes. Yeah, no, I don't go fast, I just wanna feel it. Are you feeling it, Mr. Krabs? I'm not feeling nothing right now. Yours feels stiff. Does it? Yeah. Well, you're also in the mud. I know, oh. <laughs> Definitely something to get used to. Definitely totally different. What? Four stroke compared to this. What do you think of between the two? This one's got more balls. What the frick's this mud you got on the seat? That was because you, this bike threw it at it. That thing's a freaking animal. This one's got so much power, it's just, you know. I think I like your handlebars better. The track is mostly underwater, it seems. I don't know, this freaking root caught my front tire and wiped me out right here. Jake is currently cleaning up the bikes. I gotta replace the brakes. I did the front, but now I need the backs. I mean, that's that has no pad on it. At least Jake's garbage ones did. Jake and I are getting a quick snack before Jake has to go to work. And uh, Jake's got a science experiment in the kitchen. Hey! 
I hope I have everything. You guys ever run into the same problem? Like you leave, you bring a whole bunch of stuff to people's houses and then you leave and you forget something? It happens to me all the time. But as you can see in the back, you know, on my dirt bike, that is one thing I left behind, but I did that intentionally. Jake took off to work. I'm going home. Not sure what kind of trouble I'm going to get into, but uh, hopefully it's not too much trouble. <laughs>